Welcome to the guided tour of Puyu Parish and the ironworks of Rasebori. It consists of three parts. Puyu Past and Present, Fiskars Ironworks and Svarto. This tour has been funded by Westmulenska Kultursamfundet as an EU project. Puyu Past and Present On the 1st of January 2009, the 28,000 inhabitants of Ekenes, Karis and Puyu were brought together to form the collective town of Rasebori, although each was to maintain its identity and original name. The Puyu area has been inhabited for at least 6,000 years. Spearheads, hammerstones and axes are among the many finds from various ages. Puyu Bay has provided a natural route towards inland Finland since the Bronze and Iron Ages. The Swedish colonization of the area began in the 12th century, when the coastal regions had been relatively uninhabited for a long period of time. The parish of Puyu is mentioned for the first time in 1359. During the 17th century, Puyu underwent considerable change with the creation of a number of ironworks in the area. The first of these was founded in Antskog in 1630 by Jakob Volle, a wealthy merchant from Turku. In 1649, accountant Peter Turvesti founded the Fiskars Ironworks, which went on to become the most important ironworks in western Uusima. Few traces remain of many of the former manors in Puyu, although those at Bred, Torp, Mörby and Selvik are good examples of those which have stood the test of time. Kristina Abraham's daughter from Vestanbacka in Selvik is the only Finnish-born woman to have become Queen of Sweden, albeit for a very short time. King Karl Knudsson married her on his deathbed in May 1470, but her title as Queen and the inheritance of their son disappeared when Sten Sture the Elder took up the reins of power and declared the marriage invalid. Puyu Parish lies on a protected inlet of the bay, close to the historic King's Road, which stretched from Turku to Viborg. The view of Puyu Bay is today obscured by buildings and vegetation. The grey stone St. Mary's Church was built in the 15th century on a former sacrificial site and marketplace. Puyu has well-preserved industrial environments, manor houses and a thriving town life. Here, traditional handicrafts meet internationally renowned modern design. Fiskars village enjoys an excellent reputation abroad as a centre for art and design. Svarto Castle is one of Finland's most valuable manor houses, and Bilnes has become the centre for a wide range of events. Today, various public happenings, business events and conferences take place in Bilnes' old industrial quarter, which was founded in 1641. Accommodation facilities, as well as the local restaurant and café trade, have also expanded. Bilnes Works is part of Finland's national landscape. Its traditional buildings and the beautiful view over Svarto Stream offer a unique setting for large and small events alike. Bilnes has a gardening tradition which stretches back over 350 years and boasts Finland's oldest botanical school. Bilnes has become an important centre for maintenance and restoration with its building chemist, spare parts bank and development programme. A visit to the ironworks of Fiskar, Svarto and Bilnes is guaranteed to be a rewarding experience. For more information, visit www.raseborg.fi or www.bilnas.fi. Find out more about Fiskars Ironworks in Part 2 and about Svarto in Part 3 of this guide.